First dust storm of the season rolled up into part of the valley. Look at the East Valley earlier tonight. Boy, it's been a while since we've seen one yeah, of these, right? Been. The result of storms uh, down in Tucson that moved up toward Casa Grande. Alexis Dominguez tracking the storm tonight for us until it dissipated, Alexis. Yeah, it was here and then it was gone, mm -hmm. right? So this video here was actually taken in Mesa. I was around that area in the East Valley. So I went through Tempe, I went through Mesa, and then I also went through Chandler. So it was very quick moving. But before we hit the road, I actually spoke with Arizona's climatologist about why this monsoon started a bit late. The official start to the season is June 15th, and Dr. Aaron Ann Saffel says it could be because this year's heavier snowpack took more energy to melt, which delayed the high pressure needed for these types of storms. Now, to be clear, there was no actual rain in this storm, but Arizona has only ever had six state climatologists, and Dr. Saffel is the most recent, holding the position for the past two Two years. She says we've been measuring temperatures in Phoenix since about 1895 and during that time on average there were about five days every year where Phoenix was 110 or hotter. Now this year she says so far we're at 22 days at or above 110 but Dr. Saffel says high temperatures are the first thing needed for monsoon storms to pop off. So it gets really, really hot underneath that ridge of high pressure or that heat dome. And there's a circulation around that high pressure. It moves in a clockwise manner. And what that can do is it pulls moisture into Arizona from the Sea of Cortez or the Gulf of Mexico, bringing that moisture in. And as that comes into Arizona, that can trigger our thunderstorms. Although she expects we'll break the 18 day streak record, she also expects thunderstorms will soon bring much needed relief. Now I asked if there's a way to predict what our monsoon will look like this year, whether it'll be more rain, average, or even a little bit less moisture. Unfortunately though, she says it will be a waiting game because it varies from year to year. Back to you guys.